when i saw this question i was like the answer is one now but when i took my time to look at it i was like no the answer cannot be one because if x is equal to one that means what we have is one over one plus one over one and is this equal to one so we have one over one is one and one over one is one right is this equal to one so you're going to see that two is not equal to one and that's when i said no wait though this is not as easy as i thought so let us find it ourselves welcome back to my channel um let us get straight to the point first of all let's solve this left hand side the lcm is x since they share the same denominator we pick one of them and we copy the numerator okay is equal to x so one plus one is two so we have two over x is equal to x all right now at this point what do we do let us multiply both sides by x the essence is to remove this particular x so we have x multiplied by 2 over x is equal to x so x will divide itself 1 divide itself 1 so we have 2 is equal to this is multiplied by x multiplied by x squared all right now take square root of both sides If this is the first time you have seen us, please hit that subscription button, turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss our videos. Yes, give us a thumbs up if you're actually enjoying this video. And always give us, um, anytime you watch our video and you love what we are doing, like, comment, and share. It tells the algorithm to push the video to more audience. That is to people that really need it, the students that need it for their exams. Thank you very much. All right. So, if we take square root of both sides, we will have square root of 2 is equal to square root of x squared. Now, remember that square root of a squared is equal to a. So, square root of 2 is plus or minus root 2 is equal to x now this becomes the value of x now can we verify it because that is the only way we will actually believe that the answer is true so let's verify let's verify if we do that we have the equation says 1 over x plus 1 over x is equal to x now if x let x be equal to for x equals plus root 2. Let's start with the positive one. We are going to have 1 over root 2 plus 1 over root 2. Now, is this equal to root 2? Now, we have root 2 here and we have root 2 here. So, we pick 1. And we copy the numerator. Is this equal to root 2? This seems not to be equal, right? But let's keep going. 1 plus 1 is 2 over root 2. Is this equal to root 2? Now, remember, remember that we need to rationalize this, right? If we rationalize this, we have 2 over root 2 multiplied by root 2 over root 2. Now, is this equal to root 2? So, 2 times root 2 divided by root 2 multiplied by root 2. Is this equal to root 2? Now, we can cancel. Sorry, 2 times root 2 is root 2 root 2. So, we have 2 root 2 divided by root 2 times root 2 will give us 2. Is this equal to root 2? 
now you can see that two will divide itself to give us one and we are left with root two is equal to root two so that actually proves that plus root two is the root of this particular equation now let's see if negative root two is also a root to this particular equation okay so if we do that we have one over x plus one over x is equal to x right and this uh, x is minus root two so we have one over minus root two plus one over minus root two is equal to minus root two now one over minus root two is the same thing as minus one over root two then plus times minus is minus one over root two is this equal to minus root two all right now they share the same denominator so we can pick that root two and copy the numerator right the numerator is minus one minus one now is this equal to root two minus root two sorry all right now if we solve for that we have minus one minus one is minus two so we have minus two over root two now is this equal to minus root two now we rationalize as well if we rationalize we have minus two over root two multiplied by root two over root two now is this equal to minus root two so this will give us minus two multiplied by root two is equal to root two multiplied by root two now is this equal to sorry divided by root two multiplied by root two okay now is this equal to minus root two so if you multiply this you have minus two root two divided by two now is this equal to minus root two so you can see that two we divide this we have minus one right and minus one times root two will give us minus root two so you can see that minus root two is equal to minus root two and that proves that we are correct thank you so much for watching see you in my next video bye